Hello everyone, Chief Meteorologist Brian Hale, the cold front pushing through the valley, bringing pockets of heavy rain and promising cooler weather. I think that's going to happen. We've already seen the heavy rain pockets. Now we're going to see the cooler weather filter in from the north. Daytime high on Thursday, expected to be around 70, maybe 72. And future cast, it takes us through the next 48 hours with the front, the big one, moving east through the country and south through the valley and leaving high pressure in charge and cool conditions across the country, including the valley. Futurecast, uptight and personal, shows how that front moves south of us, and we keep the chance for showers overnight, that's midnight to 1 a.m. Thursday morning. We keep the chance for showers into early Thursday, but lose it in lieu of cool, breezy, cloudy conditions for the rest of the day. And Friday, northeast breezes, plenty of clouds, and well, a little bit more comfortable. Uh, we're looking at future cast in terms of the state of Texas and temperatures, and we can see the dive in temps as the front has already pushed south of Texas by this time. Thursday afternoon, you're looking at daytime highs around the upper 60s to low 70s throughout much of the state. And then on Friday, things warm back up just a little bit more in the afternoon. Doesn't take long around these parts, does it? Uh, overrunning situation, in other words, moisture in the mid-levels will continue to stream across the valley, providing... Plenty of clouds, not enough to provide showers, but keeping mostly cloudy in the forecast Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. A coastal trough setting up shop uh, should give us a chance for showers Monday and Tuesday, but just a slight chance that's your uh, Veterans Day there on Monday. That's a look at your 24-7 forecast.